everybody welcome back to my channel i am doing another ac fabulous confessions video and thanks to leyline brown uh, i can do a video for you all um so she sent me an email and i asked her like can you give me some topics about anything um and she sent me an email saying i can talk about how i build my confidence um, and I'm going to also talk about the other one in the other video. And it says you can talk about how girls should value themselves. So that's going to be my next video. So thank you, girls. Shout out to Layline Brown. Mwah. Okay, so how I build my confidence. Okay, um, so when I was a little girl, I always was that person who had a lot of confidence um i look good i was always that girl who wore heels even at a young age i wore heels um i want to be like a grown-up and i was always dressing like a grown-up i always wanted to wear the heels i always wanted to wear the long hair um the nails all of that um so that's what i always wanted to do and that's how I was that's how I was brought up that's how I taught myself to be that way and then I see like um, women who have their hair looking good and then I see them get a lot of compliments so I said hey I'm gonna try that and see if I get compliments and it always piggyback off each other like that I am um, either check the outfits and all this stuff and that's how I built my confidence I always had self-confidence even since I was like a little girl um so that how I did that that's how I got my confidence up um and also my mama she always told me I was pretty she always told me she loved me she always gave me that boost of confidence every time I walk outside of the house just to go to school she always like gave me that boost of confidence if that makes any sense and she just encouraged me even when I felt like I was going to fail she said it's okay but you are still beautiful you are still going to make it you're still going to do that so she has been my confidence booster my um mama and my grandmother they both made me this way um very confident very happy about life um stuff like that so thank you to my mother and my grandmama for giving me that confidence um so let me give you all some tips on how to be confident okay so i'm gonna give y'all five tips on how to be confident first the first tip is attitude, boo, attitude. Um, it's all about how you walk into a room. It's all about how you make yourself known. What's your um, reputation, if, that, if I should say that. Um, your reputation, it's all about how you value yourself, how you put yourself out there. And a lot of people have a lot of stink attitudes, but they're still confident. I don't see that. I just see that as stink attitude. Um, one, that confidence should be in you. Um, anybody could be confident. Everybody could be confident. But it all depends on how you carry yourself, meaning the attitude. Um, you should always be humble, never cocky. Because there's a difference between cocky and humble. I mean, cocky and um, confident. And... You don't want to just walk into a room and say, F everybody, who can't see, can't walk, F everybody. No, you shouldn't be like that. You should be humble. You should, um, like, be more happy with what people give you. Like, if they give you a gift that you don't really care for, um, still be like, thank you so much. Don't be like, I don't like this gift. You know, so it's all about how you carry yourself. So that's the attitude. That's number one. Number two, it's about how you appear everybody want to see how you look it all depends on how you look because when i throw on a cute outfit and my shoes looking good and my purse is popping yes hunty i feel great so it's all up it all depends on what you're wearing because your appearance could bring out your confidence so much better um along with the attitude so just have a cute bomb ASS outfit okay girl so just do that um you can actually go on the internet or you can go on my channel <laughs> and see like how I match and match things together to make it cute 
and that's how I do it. Um, when I don't have any ideas in my head, I go on YouTube, I go on the internet and see what I can mix and match together to make a cute outfit. Okay, so the third tip is hair. This goes for men and ladies. Your hair is like very, 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 very important. Um, when you walk out the house, you want to make sure your hair is on point. Fellas, if you have dreads or if you have like a little fade or whatever that you have going on with your hair, make sure it's beautiful. Make sure it's good. Make sure it looks handsome, man. I'm um, being serious because I'm starting to see this nappy boy hairstyle. And I don't really like it. Go back to the waves. Please go back to the waves. For me. <laughs> um, but make sure you have your hair tight. Make sure it looks good. You know what I'm saying? And for the ladies, make sure your hair is on point. Um, everything about your hair describes you. If your hair looking nappy and jacked up, that's not going to be cute. Nobody want to talk to a nappy headed girl. So make sure for the natural ladies, make sure your hair is looking beautiful and flawless and beautiful and put together. You know what I'm saying? And then for the ladies who wear weaves, uh, make sure your weave is tight and right. Okay? So yeah, it all depends on your hair. So make sure your hair is looking good. Okay. So for the fourth one, I have take pride in yourself can y'all understand that like hear that marinate on that and feel that take pride in yourself even if somebody want to just like tell you that you're fat you're skinny you're ugly you're smelly whatever take pride in yourself this is your body right this is your body take pride in yourself take care of yourself smell good do your hair um dress up um you know acknowledge your talents acknowledge your your things that you like to do your hobbies anything just take pride in yourself because you are a, a beautiful and unique person um a lot of people have problems with that they think that everything about them is negative everything about them is wrong and i'm here to tell you today darlings that you are okay the way you are god made us in a beautiful and unique way so take pride in yourself you understand me I don't want y'all leaving this video saying that, oh dang, she ain't gave me no help. She didn't help me out with this confidence thing. Yes, I did. And I want you to know that you are beautiful and you are a handsome person, okay? AC Fabulous loves you, all right? Okay. Um, <laughs> so for the fifth one, okay, don't be afraid to push yourself beyond your limits. Meaning, even when you feel like, dang, they might not like me because... I like this or they may not care for me because I said this don't worry about that um, you are a different and unique person and if you speak up and you tell people that hey this is what I like they probably don't like the same thing you like boo I'm being real with you um so push yourself don't be so afraid to be like out of the box and even out that box box okay um confidence is what you put into it confidence is something that you want to work on if you want to work on that listen to these tips okay do what you gotta do and you want to be confident it's all about you it all starts with you so I hope these tips helped you all be a little bit more confident and brighten up your day. So, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time.